The eight-storey tall Masjid Amar and Osman Ramju Sadiq Islamic Centre is located in Wan Chai. This Islamic Centre is unique as it houses different function spaces within, allowing for a wide variety of Islamic services to the Muslim residents here. We are here to meet Mr. Ma, Chairman of the Dakwa Committee who has been in charge of the Islamic Centre's operations for the past three years. He tells us more about the Islamic Centre's activities during Ramadan. We have a canteen, we dance there, and every day all the brothers and sisters they will come for iftar. Yeah. Uh, normally in the weekday it's around 100 to 200, but the end of the week will be very crowded. I see. Yeah, easy. Uh, Less than about thousand. In the daytime, it's not very, very much. After, but after, uh, I mean, after iftar and yeah. after the office hour, yeah. they will all come together through the whole light. Uh, the whole light. Um, I say it's around, around one hundred. On the second floor of the building, religious classes are being held. During Ramadan, these classes are held every day except Friday which is a mandatory praying day for all Muslims. These children in particular are from Pakistan and they come by immediately after school. It's 4 p.m. and classes are about to begin. Yet children aren't the only ones attending classes here. During Ramadan, classes for women are conducted as well on Tuesdays, Wednesdays and the weekend. This particular class caters to immigrant Muslims who not only attend to learn about Islam but also as a support group. Kebetulan saya kalau berkunjung ke ke Hong Kong pada bulan Ramadan saja. Nah, setiap Ramadan saya insya Allah datang ke sini kemudian mengajar setiap hari dari mulai hari Senin sampai hari Minggu. Di Hong Kong sekalipun umat Islam orang Islamnya hanya berjumlah sedikit sekitar 120 ribuan tetapi mereka punya kesempatan untuk melaksanakan ajaran Islam dengan baik dan terasa sekali apa namanya suasana ya, suasana bulan Ramadan terutama di Masjid Bancai karena nanti pada saat berbuka kita buka bersama memakan makan semacam kurma ada juga hidangan-hidangan tradisional seperti di Indonesia Jadi suasana Ramadan di Indonesia sebetulnya terasa sekali dengan di Hong Kong ini. According to Mr. Udin Kamiludin, the immigrants still retain their culture and religious practices here in Hong Kong. They also have no problem accessing their favorite traditional cuisines, especially during Ramadan. However, adapting to life in a foreign country is never easy and it's no different for these women. Nevertheless, they still find ways to celebrate Ramadan, despite missing the Ramadan atmosphere of their home countries. In many ways, the Masjid Amar and Osman Ramju Sadiq Islamic Centre is not just a mosque, but a community centre as well.